<clears throat> hey there, Libras. And it's Lori here to do your daily. Let's get right into it. Do a quick shuffle. Hope you're all doing well. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. Drop me a comment. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already so you can be part of the community. All right. Got some good energy here. All right. Ten of Swords. Wow, that's potent energy. Okay, um, feeling uh, betrayed. Yesterday should have been a good day. I'm pretty sure it was ending pretty well for you. Feeling a little stressed today. Feeling a little trapped inside your head. Got the King of Pentacles today. Yeah, feeling... Um, you will feel better throughout the day. There will be some sort of um, vindication. I don't. I'm. I'm not saying vindictiveness. Um, but like something happened, and karma's gonna come back around. Okay. So you've put out some good energy recently. You're gonna be putting out some more to somebody in your past, or something from your past who comes back around. In the past, it hurt you a lot. However, there's going to be a fresh start with this. Um, there is going to be fairness, vindication. So whatever, you know, wasn't right in the past will be right now. <clears throat> will be made right here in the future. Got a nice inspired fresh start here. Well, we've also got a King of Wands here, Seven of Wands, and the Ten of Swords. So we got the Ten of Swords here, so this is clarifying over here. Um, feeling like you've had to defend yourself, stand your ground, put some walls up against all this pain, heartache that your King of Wands has been causing you, okay? Got the Knight of Wands, so some inconsistent behavior here. Things that were hidden from you. Secrets. Yeah. Feeling like you've sacrificed a lot. All right. Let's go ahead and clarify the Eight of Swords and King of Pentacles, please. We've got the Queen of Pentacles. So we've got a true pair here again. This could be a husband-wife situation. Um, Long-term partner. Something that they've said or done has got you all up in your head. Um, hmm. right now you're focused on uh, yourself trying to resolve this situation peacefully yeah you've def definitely got some walls up against this person this situation all right let's go ahead and clarify the nine of wands please can we get clarification Clarification of the Nine of Wands over the Ace of Wands. We've got the Four of Cups and the Eight of Wands. <laughs> so you're unhappy that you're having to wait to hear back from somebody. You want to clear the air. You want to get um, things straightened out. You're ready to make some magic happen here. Yeah, and you're feeling like you can do it. Your intuition's telling you you can make whatever you want to have happen, happen, except for you're stuck waiting. You're just stuck waiting. Let's see what the Sempress Energy and the Six of Cups means for you, please. The Sun. Yeah, something from your past is coming back around, and it is really going to make you feel abundant, happy. Bring out a brand new day. Could be someone younger than you, possibly a grandchild's coming to visit. Yeah, we've got some justice going on here. We have some sneakiness here. I'm getting that that this energy I was feeling at the beginning. All right, let's go ahead and clarify the Three of Swords and the Hierophant, please, for the Libra Collective.
clarification, please. Thank you. Ace of Wands. Okay, so the, whatever hurts and pains and whatever has happened, because of this hermit being here, we saw the Justice card. We do have things working out in your favor. Um, somebody may have broken a promise is what I'm hearing. But there is still passion here. Okay, there is still a foundation to build from. You could be dealing with a Virgo. That's the energy of the Hermit card here. However, I'm not getting that to be. Um, I'm getting more of a sense of you taking yourself out of the situation and really looking deep within to see what part you may have played in whatever's happening here. But what you really want is just to go in a different direction that that smooths the water, is what I'm hearing. Take things in a different direction. There's a victory for you. It didn't actually come out, but let's see what else came out with it. The moon and the knight of cups. So there might be an apology here. Something you didn't know, okay? There is something I, I think that um, you just didn't realize. And I think somebody's going to come talk to you about that. All right. Anything else? Yeah, Five of Swords. There's, There's been some sort of lies or deception. Something happened here, okay? Um, you know it, but you don't want to admit to the truth. Queen of Swords. Yeah, that's she's cold. All right, so I think somebody probably threw some truth at you, and you didn't want to hear it. You didn't want to believe it. You don't want to admit it. But there's going to be a judgment call on it. Ooh, and you're going to boss up. You're going to stand in your element. All right. Got the King of Pentacles again on the bottom of the deck here. Ten of Pentacles. I think things are going to turn out just fine. Yeah. Clear the air. Things are going to work out. Let's see what your outcome is going to be. Five of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, and the Wheel of Fortune. Okay, so um, Five of Pentacles talks about whatever um, being left out in the cold, but it also talks about sanctuary, forgiveness. Okay, so I think there's some sort of forgiveness going to happen here. Um, you may be offering a gift to someone, or someone may be offering you a gift, a truce, and it does turn the Wheel of Fortune into your favor. So this looks really good. It looks like by the end of the day, things will be patched up. All right, my Libras, I hope you enjoyed this reading. If you did, go ahead and give the video a thumbs up. Drop me a comment. Subscribe to the channel if you have not done so already. Until our energies cross again, I'm wishing you much peace, love, and happiness. Bye-bye.